Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 29 of Let's Play Shimigami Tensei Nocturne. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, that last episode was a bit of a garbage fire, and I'm really glad we got that over with. Someone in the comments said for me that I should get Dece back, because it was close to evolving into a Valkyrie. Apparently it's not at level 25, but just a little bit further. So this new and abapt Katha... I can't make a Sarzahiko out of it. I do like Warcry. And sadly, that's the only spell I'm gonna get, because obviously... I really haven't been training either of these demons. And who knows, maybe Sarzahiko... I could change into something else. I can make a Barith out of that in Mizuchi. I can make an Ankot with the Orthrus. Hmm. Resist physical, and it's weak against curse and nerve. And I'll get Tetracarn soon. Toxic Sting and Left the Toma. Toxic Sting and Light Toma. Um, is that what I want to go with? I guess it doesn't hurt. Yeah, we'll, we'll go with that. I'll probably put a little bit more work in expanding my bestiary once I have a steadier flow of money. Now, what can I do with the Ankot? Huh, Kaiwan. Oh, I think I can make one of those. And an Aquans. Don't know if I want to go that route yet. I think this is what we're going to stick with for now. And I think before we go to Mifunashiro, I think, I think I'm pronouncing it right, why don't I take the entrance over to the left? Or rather, the exit to the left. Because I don't think I really explored that building. Or I did, and that's where I saw the blood. So I'm like, maybe I should go investigate that. It would be a wise idea. Okay, I do have like a full party. Wanted to make sure that I still had four party members in there. Yeah, I only stopped around here briefly and then gave up. Seems like it's leading that way. Oh, by the way, that my main character did get an extra bit of agility. Because when my Orthrus leveled up, it gave me an agility incense. I didn't think you could get incense just by demons leveling up. That's cool. Sakahagi ruins our peace. He's an evil mannequin. Oh, I don't see him. Is it a good idea for me to come here? Uh, oh, oh, it's Sa Sakahagi. Th that traitor, Sakahagi, is going wild up ahead. This doesn't feel like a good idea. Maybe I shouldn't go this way yet. It, it just seems like suicide. I know it sounds cowardly, but I gotta sustain myself here. At least this fight's pretty easy too. Oh, Daisojo is close to a level. Shh. Sakahagi will find me. Go away! Yeah, we'll, we'll come here later. This doesn't seem like a wise choice to do this part yet. I never even checked it out between episodes, so, like... 
it's it'll be new to me as well. Alright, level up. Did you get Preach yet? Yes. Alright, so what is Preach? Okay, inflicts mine. It's mine status and can inflict charm, panic, and sleep on all enemies. And costs only 15 MP! What a deal! Especially if they're actually weak against status ailments. I think it inflicts damage as well. So that'd be a good spell to use. If not to inflict ailments, at least to hurt them. I didn't save since uh, getting those demons fused, did I? No, I did not. How is Mizuchi doing? I, I think that's close to evolving as well. Might be another little while, though. As much as I like Baphomet, I'm gonna give him a break. Put Mizuchi in. That might be a wise choice for temporary precautions. Alright, so I'm recording this like literally the day before Canada Day. And I actually have no plans whatsoever. Of course, this episode will be up sometime after. Not that much ahead, but, you know, getting there. And, uh, we'll take it from there. I suppose later on, I'm gonna have to check out the Labyrinth of Amala again. <coughs> like, now that I'm able to access the second Kalpa. That might be something I'll need to do. So let's get to that later on. Then. For now, I'm gonna check out Mifunashiro. So unfortunately, I do have to go all the way around again. But seeing as how we've been here before, it shouldn't be that hard to find. I forgot you gotta go down the stairs first before you can access the map. And it's over that way. Good. Hi. Die. <laughs> Alright, let's try out Preach. Okay, it doesn't do damage. I must have been thinking of something else. Don't mind me, I'm dumb. And apparently they were all resistant to it, so it didn't matter. Please, how the hell can you see me anyway? You don't even have eyes. I'm really glad that I replaced Lunge with Divine Shot that I got from Nirvana. It does more damage in lunge, but I think it has a greater chance of missing. But all the times I've used it, I never missed yet, so... I don't think I have anything to worry about. I'll show it off, maybe, right now. Oh, oh, hi. Look at that damage. That pretty cool or what? Gex 6 experience. Those were enemies I fought at the hospital in Shinjuku. God, the random enemy spread for this area is so wide. Like enemies you'll find here exclusively. And then enemies you'll find in like very late part of the game. Is it this way to be for Shiro? I think so. Uh, yes, okay. 
Uh, it wasn't red. Unless I'm thinking out of my ass. God, it's just like Mega Man holding an X Buster. Mega Buster. It's X holding the X Buster, Mega Man holding the Mega Buster. That's, that's what, I literally have crib notes for that. And I started my Let's Play career playing Mega Man. Pretty much. I mean, yeah, there was a hack that I did. Like an SMB1 hack. That just replaced Mario with Link. And it was kind of broken. I'm not even taking that much damage from this counter anymore. Alright, everything should be fine now. Is it this way? Well, none of you guys resist force, so here you go. Well, that was easy. Okay, D's got less than 4,000 experience to go. I'm actually not going to save. I don't feel that what's up ahead in Mifunoshiro is going to be too hard. Maybe I'll save on the way back. What is here, anyway? Ah, I actually was pronouncing the name right. Okay, well this part seems safe. Hold on, there's a door over here. Oh, a regular terminal! Huh, okay, well... I guess it's a good thing I did not save. Because then I'd be saving here, too! Alright! Got ourselves another warp. So now we can just, you know, head back to Asakusa normally. If I'd known that this was here, I should have done that first. Saved us a little bit of time. Why does a door shape look similar to a Mala? Hello, and welcome. Just as I foresaw, you have come to Asakusa. We are fated to meet again. Although, that is all I can say at this point. Have you looked around Asakusa? Everyone is doing their best to restore the city. This is the first city we mannequins have ever considered as our own, after all. However, though you may see our land, you may not enter it any further. This is the holy land of the mannequins, Ifunashiro. Beyond here is our motherland, where we were born. Even if we owe you our lives, I cannot allow you past here. I'm truly sorry. Now, I must return to my meditations. I have to foresee our new future. I need to find out what I can do to create a world where mannequins can live in peace. Oh yes, beware of a mannequin named Sakahagi. He's a traitor to our cause, having committed various atrocities. He's probably hiding out somewhere in Asakusa. He might cause you some trouble, but please understand that he is not one of us. Now, I must be going. And he left. And the door's closed tight. Aww. Alright, well, I guess we're not able to go in there. Alright, let's head back to Asakusa. And I should go check up on uh, Buddy. See if he found out anything. Hey, don't rush me! You don't want me to miss something important, do ya? I'm gonna save again, and the reason why 
is because maybe I do need to find the Sakahagi individual. Nothing else seems to be happening, and I wasn't given any clear directions on where I should go. So I guess I'll just come out here. Oops. I'm only going to do this to recover my MP. And surprisingly, only three of my demons had to recover anything. Yeah, you do that. Um, should I consider looking for Sakahagi? I guess it wouldn't hurt to check. And if I die, I mean, I'll just end up back near the save point anyway. And I'll find out, oh, that's not what I need to do. Usually death will give you a pretty good indicator if that's what you're supposed to do or not. Don't apply that to real life, by the way. Okay, if I remember correctly, it was this door. You should have just handed over your Magatsui! But instead, you decided to oppose me. That was too funny. Well, I'm not complaining. Now I have this new skin to add to my collection. He's wearing faces. Who's there? Damn. You had me scared for a second. I thought those mannequins were back. They're pretty weak. I'll let him accept this one guy that escaped from the mantra. He's been giving me a headache recently. Would have made my life a lot easier if he'd been killed in Ike Bakuro. I should thank him, though, for bringing his followers here. It's like free Magatsui. I've been collecting Magatsui. Eventually, I'll have enough power to dominate all demons. You're a demon. You know how it is. You're thirsty for some Magatsui yourself, aren't you? No, not really. You don't want Magatsui? You're one weird demon. Well, it's time for me to go. Maybe we'll meet again. Maybe not. We'll see. Just remember, I'm Sakahagi, the future ruler of the demons. Huh, alright. Aww. I live. Oh! That's not cool. Okay, well, that didn't really get me anywhere. Maybe I should talk to someone now. Perhaps something now actually happened. still fight. Okay, good. Now it's just you. I'll feel bad for you, bub. Maybe I should have used Tornado instead, but eh. Can you imagine if you could counter a counter? And it would just be like playing tennis with your fists. That's what I would become. Hilarious. Maybe I was just supposed to run into Sakahagi to trigger one of the flags? As in the flags of continuing the game? I, I guess. I can't really do anything now. The other thing I can do is try for a second Kalpa. So remember, I wasn't able to get there before, but since I got that candelabrum from Hellbiker, I can now? Which is pretty awesome. Oh, 
Oh, music is different. Yeah, that was a flag. Hey, good timing. How was Askusa? That was awesome, except for that, you know, that atrocity. Oh, and, uh, some guy getting killed. About the nightmare system, I've got good news. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. So here, take a look. You see it? That's the obelisk in Kyoto. The nightmare system's inside it, along with all the Magatsui that's been collected. In other words, we found Nihilo's current headquarters. The system is probably being operated by that woman they call the Maiden. I have no idea how it works, but we know it's dangerous. And very phallic. If I could, I'd go in there myself. But I'm just but I'm just not strong enough. However, if no one does anything, Hikawa will take over the world for sure. I'm afraid I have to ask for your help again, Mira McCheese. You must stop the nightmare system inside the obelisk, and return the flow of Magatsui in the Vortex world back to normal. Use the secondary entrance to Nilo's old headquarters to reach the obelisk. That entrance is locked right now, but I can take care of it. With this terminal, it'll be a piece of cake. The obelisk looks pretty tall, and who knows what kind of demons are going to be there. We don't know what kind of power this so-called Maiden has, either. It's not gonna be easy, that's for sure. But, I know you can do it. And he just stares at it again. Alright, so I think I'm getting a good clue as to what I should be doing right now. Actually, what I should do... The reason why I'm going back to the Great Underpass of Ginza is because that's where I can buy Chakra Drops. And again, I'll exploit the system on just buying two at a time, every time, to get more lucky tickets. Maybe I can get another incense that will, uh, get me over the hump. Because I think somebody told me in the comments that, like, oh, you're buffing a certain kind of stat, which I believe was luck at the time. Well, you're not going to like which I think is coming up in the second or third Kalpa. I think what that means is, in order for you to progress, you need to have your stat a certain number. And I don't know what stat it is, but it might not be the one that I've been buffing. Okay, I only got one lucky ticket, so it'll probably be a little while. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna stop here, and in the next episode, we'll uh, continue on for the second Kalpa Namala. Goodbye, everyone. Thanks for watching.